The conflict between Cameron and Callum continues to develop in chapter 1546. As they struggle with their emotions and the outside forces that influence their relationship. This chapter goes deeply into their intricate dynamics while exposing their weaknesses, anxieties, and unyielding resolve. Cameron is visibly torn within as the chapter begins, inward liberating Callum for his steadfast efforts to keep her safe. Callum moves and helps her right away when she hesitantly agrees and steps out of her car. As he gently leads her to his car and makes a serious promise to be the one to take her there every day, his tenderness and resolve are obvious. The moment Callum introduces James and Adam as Cameron's bodyguards becomes crucial. In reaction to any threats she might encounter because of her fragility, these bodyguards have been called in from the mansion to protect her. The fact that Callum decided to offer this level of protection shows how deeply concerned he is for her welfare and how willing he is to go to such measures to keep her safe. Cameron's opposition to the bodyguard's presence reflects her independence and distaste for being constantly watched. But Callum's pragmatic thinking wins through as he stresses the need for safety in strange places and any potential risks that might exist. Callum responds to her worries by offering a solution that the bodyguards are meant to defend her rather than watch over her. His unshakable resolve is evident throughout their conversation. He openly expresses his suffering throughout Cameron's avoidance, revealing his true dread of losing her. His openness humanizes him and exposes his significant emotional interest in their connection. As Cameron struggles with Callum's honesty and intentions, her inner anguish is increasingly exposed. She is rendered speechless when Callum confesses his emotions for her, which causes her to reevaluate her beliefs and her sense of self worth. The intensity of their emotional bond and Callum's unwavering resolve are shown in this touching chapter.